Hello guys, in this video you will learn how to deploy your own BIP20 token, a token on BNB Smart Chain, using Remix of course. Okay, uh, there is two types of tokens, a standard token, this means a token doesn't have any additional functions and doesn't collect attacks, it is a very pure token. The most people prefer this token, especially the investors, because this is a very safe token. And also you will learn how to deploy a token that take attacks when the holders buy or sell your token you can collect some tax we will learn both okay the first step we need to get a contract code okay if you have a contract code it's okay that's very nice if you don't have a contract code you can download a code from zerox-factory.com. okay let's move to the next step how to download the token contract from zerox-factory.com visit zerox-factory.com and click downloads here in the download page you will find many things to download decentralized application but scroll down until reach this section download solidity smart contract code okay we have two types the standard token mean no tax and bit 20 token contract that take BNB tax Okay, download whatever you like. The price for every smart contract is only $5. Okay, for example, we will download the standard token. Click download. You need to connect with your wallet, MetaMask or Trust Wallet. After you connect, click download again. You will find here many payment options. You can be using BNB or USDT or USDX or USDC. Just click the method you prefer to pay. And after the transaction completed, you will download automatically the code, whatever standard code or BIP20 token. This is the standard token. You will download standard token.zip. Okay, extract this file and open the file using any text editor. Sublime text, for example. We just need to copy this code and close Sublime text and open Remix. Here in Remix, we need to create our new contract file. Click create new file, for example, token.sol and paste here your code. This is the standard token code. Okay, scroll down until reach this line. Yes, this line, the line number 319 here you will find the constructor here you can add your token details like the token name here and the token sample like BTC for example and the decimal 18 by default you can leave it like that and here the total supply if you want your token total supply 1 billion just type here 1 billion 10 million or whatever you want so type here the total supply of your token and also it is better to rename the contract by your token if your token x token for example type here x token make the contract the same name of your token but of course without spaces okay after you finish all this edit click solidity compiler and uh, this is the default compiler is 5.16 and no problem to use this compiler for the standard token okay i prefer always to make enable optimization and click compile token.sol file after compilation finished click deploy and here from environment select injected provider metamask you have to connect remix with your metamask okay now i'm connected and here choose the contract name for example basic token here and token.ocl this is the file so select the contract name here basic token select here also basic token and after that click deploy when you click deploy of course because i don't have enough balance on this wallet so i cannot deploy but the deployment is very cheap it will cost you only one dollars point 78 cents okay less than two dollars after that click confirm if you have enough balance just click confirm after you click confirm the token will create it and will send it to the wallet the connected wallet okay 
let's reject this and remove all this data and back again to the other type of token the tokens just uh, that collect attacks bit 20 token this contract collect attacks extract this contract and open the file again by any text editor and copy all the code close this and back again to remix and paste this code this is the contract that collect attacks okay let's scroll down or up until reach the constructor also okay great this is the contract the default name is token you have to change this contract name by your token name it is better to do that here in the line number 561 the token name type here your token name and here your token symbol and it is better to leave the decimal default 18 and here the total supply of your token if your token 100 million type here 100 million and the most important point here the fees the liquidity fee here in this line 566 liquidity fee by default 2 mean 2% and this 2% will divide it into two parts. 50% from this amount will go to the liquidity pool to increase the liquidity pool and 50 cents will send it to the owner's wallet or your wallet, okay, as a tax. After you finish all this edit, you only need to edit the total number, the total supply, I mean, the token name, the token symbol, and here the liquidity fee. And of course, later, uh, from BSC scan you can change this liquidity so you can start it by zero or start it by any percent you like okay after you finish all this edit again back to the compiler but here you can compile this uh, contract by the latest compiler no problem at all just click compile a token okay after compile finish, let's back again to be sure you are injected provider MetaMask. And here type select a token. This is the contract name, okay, because we want to deploy this contract, the token contract. In your case, of course, this will be your token name, okay. Click this contract and here you need only to add the owner address. Copy and paste your wallet address here because this will be the owner address and click deploy. MetaMask will pop up to ask you to confirm the transaction. Click confirm and after that the, the token will send it to the owner address. That is all, nothing more. So you learn it how to deploy both standard and tax tokens. Thanks for watching and good luck for all.